Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Tim Hofstetter here at Supple Touch Dermatology in Hornsby Oaks, California. Uh, today we have Martin with us. He's a first time patient and he's come in for a preliminary examination. So uh, Martin, what brings you in today? Well, I've been noticing a, a burning sensation. Okay, well, let's take a look. Okay. Oh my, I see. Okay, Martin here is suffering from a case of cytophilliptic pouch disease, also known as kangaroo cancer. What? Oh, it's completely benign. All right, Martin, we're going to have you cleaned up in a GIF and we'll have you on the road to recovery, so don't you worry. Okay. Okay. Let's get started. All right. There we go. These pouches can be like big belly buttons, attracting all sorts of debris. Okay. This is worse than between my couch cushions. Okay. It's very important to clear the pouch entirely before attempting any rehabilitation. Stubborn one. All right. There we go. Okay. All right. Okay, so I have cleaned out the pouch and injected an anti-inflammatory steroid. Martin here will have to follow a very strict skin conditioning routine, but the tissue should return to its normal size in about a month. Thank you, doctor. I'll tell you, I've been putting it off, getting it checked out for a long time, and I figured now is the time to deal with it. Besides, I had no use for that one. I'm sorry, are you experiencing this condition on another part of your body? That's nothing. I'm not concerned. Martin, this is a very serious condition. and Left untreated, it could be a big problem. Oh. Oh, let's take a look. Oh my, oh my goodness. This is very serious. We're gonna have to have this removed. But it's benign. Okay, this is quite a bundle. Well, it's like a little Santa sack. Okay. All right. Wonderful. Okay. Oh, a little stowaway. Okay. Okay, mucus buildup like this is very common. And for those who are wondering, it has a scent much like gasoline and porcini mushrooms. Okay. Okay, put that in the college fund. One big scoop for mom. That's what she always used to say. 
Here we go. Now I will clean and hydrate the skin using Heckman Sterilizing Spray, available at buyheckmanskinproducts.com. Okay now, just a quick snip and you'll be on your way. Can't we just leave it? Not unless you want to be covered in pockets in about a month. Okay, and there we go. It is very important to make an even cut to minimize the scarring. Perfect. Just a couple quick snips. Oh. That's right. This takes uh, precision. I remember doing this on a pig in medical school. It did not come out quite so pretty. There we go. Just a little, yep. Well. All right, this is coming along nicely. Just a historical note. The largest pouch ever removed was at the 1937 World's Fair, where an invention called the scalper was used to remove a 10-inch pouch from the head of then Secretary of State Jonah Wild. All right, this may be a new world record. I can't wait to weigh it. That's it for today, folks. I'm gonna have Sasha stitch him up, and Martin will follow up in about six weeks. I wanna thank Martin for coming in, and I wanna thank you for tuning in. Remember, Follow me on all platforms at Dr. Puss. Until next time, remember to be kind, drink lots of water, and wash behind your ears. Thank you, everyone.